Well, our Thursday continues. Now, we're going to go hour by hour. This is going to give you an idea of those winds uh, to 20 miles an hour by noon, but 71 degrees. We're going to have uh, winds escalating through the afternoon, gust to 40 possible, uh, 76 are high today, but we'll see the windy conditions really correspond to 3, 4, 5 o'clock. Um, so just be aware of that. And again, we get into the evening hours. While we start to see it taper off, it'll be after sunset that we really see a noticeable break. But temperatures at 8 o'clock, still into the mid-60s, just going to be windy. The wind gusts stay, 45 mile an hour winds possible. Those are the gusts. And we'll see those gusting to 35 later on this afternoon, and then it'll be less overnight. A wind advisory for the Central Basin, that's from Lincoln County all the way across to the Cascades. We are going to see blowing dust uh, more than likely, Ritzville and Moses Lake. So we want you to be on the, the lookout. We have in the past seen dust can you know shut down I-90 for a period of time until it calms down the forecast radar. Yeah, it's going to be a combination of sun, clouds, and then we're going to see scattered showers coming in to uh, Republic, perhaps into the higher elevations of Idaho, and then south of Spokane overnight into the Palouse, and that'll work its way up into the mountains of Idaho and Montana. Um, that'll push over. We'll see the chance of maybe a few scattered showers <clears throat> really for um, Friday in and around the area. We're not uh, about a 20% chance of that happening. And then we're going to see things really clear out for Saturday. Calm down, and it looks pretty good. Could there be a couple scattered showers in the uh, afternoon, evening? Yeah, but it's not looking great for that. So that's good news because we got a parade. All right, here are the winds. They continue to really look at, at the afternoon gusts. And then we're going to see things calm down overnight. And then we get into Friday, and we see them fire back up again. By Friday, you're heading home. Less wind overnight, Saturday looking pretty good. Here's a look at the planning forecast. With 76 the high today, 64 tomorrow, and then we're into um, the mid-60s again on Saturday. Calmer, cooler, and then Sunday, 62. Have a great day. The weather conversation and what you need to know is also on the weather app. Uh, the First Alert weather app free and available in the App Store.